Hello, this is Al Church, and I'm going to show you a little bit about Google Classroom. This is online, so what you'll want to do is fire up your browser. In your browser, you will want to go to classroom.google.com. You will need your child's Google email address, or better yet, have your child right there with you, and your child can show you Google Classroom. These are the kind of things that you're going to see once you sign in. The first page you will see is the classes page. On the classes page you will see the classes that the teachers for your child have set up in Google Classroom. In the upper right hand corner you will see the email address for which your child is logged in with. This plus sign is to add a classroom manually if the teacher has given you a classroom code. And on the internet, on the you upper want to left go hand to Google Google classroom classroom menu. Com. When you click this, the default is the classes menu, which is where we are. You can look at the calendar. When you look at the calendar, it shows you the due dates for all of the classes, the assignments, the due dates, the chapters, anything that the teachers have set up. And below that, you have work. And it shows you the work that you have to do in all the different classes shows you work that you have done in all the different classes. You can sort it by just the class. For instance, I could go to keyboarding. Or I could go to science fiction. Going back to the main classroom menu, you can also see information for each and every class. You have the title of the class, you have when the class is taking place. For instance, science fiction and fantasy literature. It's first semester. Um, it's being taught by me. Underneath this will list any assignments that are coming up. Let's look inside of a class. You just need to click on the title and you're now inside the class. Science fiction and fantasy first semester. The classroom itself is divided into three different sections. You have the stream, you have the classmates, and you have the about. In the stream is where your students will find most of their work and activity. The stream is where the teachers put announcements, puts assignments, puts resources such as information, and PowerPoints and Google Slides. Sometimes in the stream you will find quizzes. For instance, here is a quiz. Would be the quiz that they would take. Okay, let us recap. Inside of the Google Classroom, your child will have a listing of every class that he or she is in. Inside of the individual class will be a stream, and the stream is filled with quizzes assignments, information, and resources the teacher wishes to give. A great resource is also the calendar, which lists all of the assignment due dates and quiz due dates. And that is a brief rundown of Google Classroom. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact me. My email address is in the description below. Have a great day.